The One Economy Foundation was established after the realization that Namibia's economy is characterized as dual-sided, one which is prosperous with access to well-developed infrastructure, while the other is largely informal and citizens in this economy is often not as privileged as the ones in the other. This contributes to more people sinking to live below the poverty line. While programs to address poverty are designed, implementing them remains a stumbling block. Poverty is multifaceted and thus requires a multi-tackling approach as outlined in the Harambe Prosperity Plan. And it's really up to us whether we want to support the implementation of that plan or not. It's really up to us to introspect and ask ourselves, well, what is it that I can do more? And you don't even have to look outside. You can look inside your house. The One Economy Foundation is a designed program with focus areas, such as entrepreneurship and enterprise development, to enable beneficiaries to access collateral free lending, among others. The First Lady feels that these are opportunities which are in some cases deliberately denied to talented and worthy Namibians by the system and that also triggers corruption. I don't think we'll ever have an equalized society, but we should have a society where if you have talent, you have hard work, you have ethics, you have drive, you should succeed. It should not depend on your surname. It should not depend on where you live. It should not depend on who you know. President Hage Gengob also demonstrated his support to the efforts of the foundation to address inequalities. Be behind them and support them. Don't just take them to your functions and they follow you. You must also follow. That's why I am here to follow Harambe. The One Economy Foundation is governed by independent, non-executive board of directors. Blanche Corises, NBC News, Ventuk.